decided today, seeing as how we're 20 episodes in and we're still alive, it's time to get our fourth badge and take on Erica. So get freaking excited and check out Friday's and Flames and Raichu! And we're about to get our fourth badge after a little swippy swappies here. We got a few new Pokemon. And now we need to figure out who our freaking team is going to be. I got so used to everyone on our team. We got some extras. We got like three fire types, two water types, two ground types. It's a mess. It's a mess. So what do we do about this? First things first, I want to take a look at... Um... The other two. Let's look at David and let's look at Xavier. Just to take a peek. We gotta see what we're dealing with here. New captures last time. David, the horsey. Still got a lot of growing up to do. We know Bubble, that's a water type attack. We don't have any other water type attacks. Xavier needs healed. Our freaking Moltres. Heck and fire spin. What to do, what to do. It's our third fire type. Alright, I should have done this before I started the episode. I'm gonna take a minute and I'm gonna deliberate. I'm gonna figure this out. See you soon. It's been tough. Because I have all these Pokemon. A lot of them are either, you know, bright, shiny new upstarts ready to come up and take the world by storm. And the others have saved our lives and been with us for a while now. And it's weird because you, you read the, the comic with the first Nuzlocke and they say, make sure you give them nicknames because you got to build that emotional attachment and all that stuff. And you're like, it's just a game. Um, no, I'm, I'm emotionally attached to freaking a lot of them. Erwin, Yugi, even freaking Brock. It's hard to, like, want to push them out after everything they've done for us. But, they're not gone. They're just chilling. Put together a team of six. And it's, it's been fun, because this is the first time this entire playthrough I've actually gotten a chance to sit down and think, who do I want? We did a little bit earlier in Cerulean City, but it was just kind of on the fly. I actually thought, we're planning out, we're strategizing, here's our team. You ready? Who do you think's on the team? Comment below. Who should be on the team? Comment below. Who did I screw up in picking and should have picked this other one instead? Comment below. Here we go! The first official member of Team Flames has to be Prince. Because I've wanted an Arcanine or Growlithe since the beginning and we got one. How am I not going to include the evolution of my favorite Pokemon? Raichu, we gotta include Arcanine. Boom. Considering a third of our Pokemon are fire types, we're bound to have another one here. And I went with Xavier because not only is he fire, he's flying. So that helps us with this ground Pokemon problem that we've been having an issue with. So now, Xavier is officially on the team. You had to be out of your mind to think I wasn't going to pick Yugi. I would have been out of my mind to not pick Yugi. Yugi has been the unofficial official leader of this team. Ever since Dreamer got sent to the Shadow Realm, Yugi has stepped up and become the leader. Yugi is the linchpin keeping this team together, and I'm not keeping that fool in the box. And Yugi has not done it alone. Erwin is on the team. We're keeping our big, bulky right on to take out. Oh, I'm turning into Hulk Hogan all of a sudden. I don't know what happened here. Erwin's on the team. We got a couple water types last time, but David was hand-picked to be part of our team. I bought him from the store. He's the only one that knows a water move and who knows when Seeking's gonna learn anything. So who knows? Hey, David is officially on the team and I couldn't be happier. There you have it. The five members of our team. What's that Raichu? There's an empty spot. 
Why did I leave an empty spot? Could I just be stupid? Could I be really risking going out with only five Pokemon? Hey, that just means we got more extras in the computer. Or it means it's time. It's time. I almost forgot, but I didn't quite forget. We're gonna pay a visit to the daycare center. Elizabeth! Queen Elizabeth! Is gonna make her friggin' return to the team! And... She's gonna have a whole new look to her, guys. She... My... I, uh, my moonstone's in the computer. My moon... I... I, ruined, I didn't... Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, the big reveal. I, I ruined it. Oh no, oh no, oh no. I ruined the big reveal. Oh man, what a waste. Hold on, 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 hold on. Wait, 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 wait. It is time! Queen Elizabeth! To join the team once again! It is our time, Raichu! Let's take a freaking look at what Elizabeth's been up to. Hey girl! Did you learn anything good in there? You sure didn't. You didn't learn crap in the daycare center. Maybe just poison sting. That, uh, that kind of bites. Dang! <laughs> so here's another idea. Let's pay a visit to the department store. Cause not only do we gotta buy some tea, we gotta. It's not even tea on this game. It's just, it's just, just a beverage. Not only do we gotta buy beverage, but they sell TMs here, and maybe just maybe there's some good TMs here. If not, everybody's learning fly. That's what we're gonna do. We have fresh water. And then, oh, someone gives us counter. Or what used to be counter. Wait, what is she? Oh, she gives us TMs too! Leech Seed might be the best TM we've seen so far. I thought that was only on later games she did that. Nice! She gets like one of each, right? And they're supposed to be like light screen, reflect, and barrier or something like that. Take a soda pop. I take it back. I take it back. That is the best TM we've gotten so far. Little girl, I love you. got it's blank no oh, she gave us counter rude can I get multiple can we get multiple you know I'm gonna hey hey come here come here come here come here oh we can't one earthquake is still better than none oh my god earthquake and leech seed so where's the guy who's supposed to give us counter? And what do you sell? Nope. Don't want. Nope. Don't want. Someone here sells TMs. Dude, if we can't learn a good moveset, because Gen 1's level up movesets are horrible, then we'll, you know, genetically modify our movesets onto our Pokemon. That's what we'll do. I have an Arcanine that flies. Thanks, Randomizer. Here's the counter, dude. What do you got? TM18. It's not counter. Twin Needle. I mean, it's a cool move. It's a bug. It's probably the best bug move in the whole game, which isn't saying much. Uh, Alright. So here's the issue here. They're all mysteries. Let's let's just go for it. 
I'm out of items. Out of space. Alright, so let's, uh... What did I make it down to? 33. Let's zoom through these! See what we got. First off, who can learn fly? Xavier's gonna learn fly also. That's stab on Xavier. TM42? Peck! Not necessary. I got fly. Why would I want peck? TM13? That's the leech seed. I kind of want... Leech seed ain't, ain't too shabby, you know? David or Elizabeth? Put her on David! Why not? A horsey with leech seed? Who's kidding? That's Peck. 48. Oh, that's Earthquake, that's right. Elizabeth can't learn. Elizabeth! Elizabeth. Darn you, randomizer! She can fly, but she can't learn Earthquake? Yugi's already. Yugi's got Thundershock. Yugi's good already. Um. Nobody! Not even Erwin! Erwin! Erwin can't learn Earth. What a freaking bummer. Well, I gotta teach it to somebody. Well, actually, no, no, we only got one, so let's just. Let's not waste it. We can use it later on down the road. Don't gotta use them all at once here. This is counter, that's gonna get sold. Twin Needle. <laughs> Let's give David all these weird little moves. Um... I'm actually gonna go out of my way. We're gonna get rid of Poison Sting for Twin Needle. Twin Needle can poison. And it's a bug type. It's not stab anymore, but I think it is stronger than Poison Sting. Alright, and these are the mystery ones. I spent money on that. Hey, dude. Uh, you can have this back. You can have this back. Uh, that's counter. 48 is Earthquake. Do not touch 48. That's Peck. Get number two. Get number seven. Get 37. We're gonna run out of money. Oh man. Let's get number one. Number five. Number nine. 17. I feel like we just had 17. I'm gonna waste money on it. Alright. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Give me something good, please! Try attack! Yes! I'm gonna waste them all on these this team and then this team's gonna get wiped out and I'm... Well, I can just buy more. It's all fine then. I don't have any normal types. Who needs good attacks? Xavier just got fly. David got... Bubble... David. David gets it. He's got bubble and leech seed. And now try attack. David, the genetically modified horsey. Minimize. Maybe. Okay, I'll hold on to it. Comet Punch. Not a fan of Comet Punch. Growth. Actually, growth. If I can. Yes, I can get it on Yugi! Ooh. Yeah, we can up our special, which will be good if we take on another Mewtwo, because that ups our special defense, too. Yeah, Yugi! Did I check this one? That's Comic Punch. This one's minimized. No, it's Thundershock. Erwin. Elizabeth. It's tempting. What's this last move? Stop. I'm gonna give it to Elizabeth instead of... It'll be better than Tackle. And then I'm actually also gonna give Elizabeth Thundershock. That's what I love about uh, Nido King and Nido Queen. They learn so much crap. Even though it's randomized and she can't learn Earthquake. Alright, let's uh... 
Do a quick little selly sell. Alright, that's Earthquake. I already forget. Comet Punch and Tackle. That's what they were. Alright, look, we got just enough money for TM17, which better be something good. Poison. It's, it's not. It's not anything good. Matter of fact, you can have that back right now. Bummer. Alright, hey, we got some good stuff out of there. I can't be mad. I'm not gonna remember who knows what. Let me do a quick rundown here. Not fly. <laughs> so who knows what? Prince knows fly. Prince is a basic Arcanine that can fly. Nothing special there. Erwin, I don't think, got anything. No, Erwin's still Erwin. Yugi now knows growth. And he's... I'm pretty sure he's going to have the highest special on our team still. David. David's got a plethora of variety over here. Xavier can now fly. And that's about it for Xavier. Elizabeth. I think... Every single one of her moves are TMs. Which is about, uh, that's about right for a Nidda Queen. <laughs> Stomp, Thundershot, Conversion, and Twin Needle. Not the best moves. It's an interesting variety. Alright, I promised a gym battle today. And by gosh, we're gonna get one. No one knows Cut. No one knows Cut. Cut's not with me. Oh man, oh man, here we go again. Oh no, oh no. Bye, George, I promise a gym battle. We're gonna get a gym battle. Todd Xavier cut. I figure it's gonna be uh, forever before he learns any other moves, so. Might as well no cut. Oh, we're here. And it might be. Might be next time. Sorry when they get to the gym, there's a lot of rearranging, we got a lot of moves, we got a new party with new moves and new move sets and new Pokemon. And everything's bright and happy and nothing bad's gonna happen in here, right? You nothing bad's gonna happen. It's gonna be a happy adventure where we win the Nuzlocke. So hit the subscribe button so you can join the Inferno and keep that fire burning strong. But nothing bad's gonna happen in here.